Hey, bud. Just lurking around, huh? I'll, I'll get to you, I think. Not an alpha Natiba, right? I shot an ordinary enemy. Oh shit, it's got lightning. Adam, get back. Oh boy. Cancel my attack! Well, I don't know what to do about this. What the fuck? You, we good? You done with the lightning bullshit now? Oh fuck. Oh fuck, I didn't know he was gonna do that. Okay. Ooh. I don't know what just happened. I don't know. <laughs> so many things are going on at once. Ow. Okay. Expect a quick time event. I started zoning out. My brain was just processing everything that was going on. I had to like let the fight catch back up in my brain. Like that was something. You defeated it, Eve. Amazing. Yeah, I sure it did. It wasn't an Alpha Nate Eva. It wasn't. But still so strong. <sighs> Things will only get harder. I bet. Maybe. Anyway, please show me the next route, Adam. Right, hold on. Let me take a look at the map data. As the crow flies, the Hall of Records isn't too far from here. But an entire block is submerged. We have to find a way to cross. Are you saying that there's no way? I found it. Do you see the sign behind the stone statue? There's a transportation device there that you can use. Oh boy! What? You really think that these abandoned devices are still going to work? Well, the supply camp was in one piece. Let's just try to stay positive. Uh-huh. Positive. Sure. Ooh, items! Beta charge gear, protection gear. Ooh, damage reduction. Oh, I think I need that. We got a lot of skill points. Might just go back down to the camp. Abaddon. Natibas are unpredictable creatures. Some resemble insects or beasts, others look like deep-sea organisms, and others are impossible to describe. 
If you see a Nativa with its body split open, spikes growing out at random, and circular horns on its head that emit electricity, it's easy to see it as a demon. For this reason, no one questions its name, Abaddon. Abaddon is strong and speedy. Keep up the pressure to counter the sword-like swings of its pro uh, pronged spikes. When Abaddon is angry, it charges electrical energy. Keep your cool in the face of danger. Abaddon has the power to harness high voltage electricity. Do not get caught up in its lightning strikes. Yeah, I kind of struggled with that a little bit. Mutated creeper. If you see any creepers with sparkling fluorescent spots on the red bodies, you must take caution. These large, strong monsters are veritable soldiers that guard their camps. And then there's the barnacle. Barnacles are nativas with thick shells, amongst other nativas that evolved amidst com competition, contamination, and predation. They were smart enough to have powerful defense. In particular, partic uh, barnacles' shell covered legs can be difficult to cut through with a single monomolecular cutter. Rather than living weapons, they are living shields. So where, where am I heading from here? I imagine, uh, here we go. What is this? Oh, another camp. Oh, shit. I thought I was going to have to go back downstairs. That one seems decent. Whoops. Delivers a sudden strike, stuns enemies, and deals high damage to their shield. Unleashes two waves of fatal energy. I wish I could see what these other trees are going to be. Interesting. I don't know what I want. I guess I'll grab a aerial blow sounds nice. And then grabbing some of these other ones, like shield breakers, probably good. Look, and I'll grab the other ability too, just to have options. Oh yeah, I should rest. I survived that damn Abaddon! I survived! Now all I have to do is get out of this building. I'll see you at the rendezvous point. Yeah, that clearly didn't work out. He didn't make it that much further. Okay, we got three enemies on this floor. We'll deal with them one at a time. Oh my god! Holy fucking tits! Well I'm sorry? My bad. I didn't know you were you were like that.
one thing I wish in this game already is just I wish getting away from enemies was like a lot more responsive. Uh, it just doesn't feel that way. <laughs> like this little this little sprint is it? Yeah. <laughs> Hopefully, I can upgrade it or something. See, like, look, I'm trying to fucking, like, god damn. I'm not trying to stand around like a fucking idiot. I swear to god, I'm, I'm trying to run away from it, but just like... I don't know. There's a lot of animations that just, like, stack on top of each other. And I'm a bit of a button masher, so that's kind of fucking me over. So I'll be simultaneously trying to like run and like also jump and then you know also like dodge and the game just doesn't know what the fuck to do <laughs> It's just like I guess we could just stand here and take, sit and die in a cloud of death. Yeah You know what? I'm... I'm killing you through retribution. I'm about to go to the camp anyway, so... Got some upgrade materials that I, I could invest in a little bit. All right, increase my attack power damage, and then rest up. Back upstairs. I just have to assume every time I engage these things that they're just gonna do the explosion thing after like the first three seconds of combat. Oh, I like canceled it out. Oh fuck. New enemy type! You enemy type! What the fuck are you? Cricket Boomer. Crickets are nativas that look like a horrid mixture of crickets and other living organisms. Their shells look like nativas. That's the same fucking description as the other cricket! They explode when they die, so don't let your guard down. Oh. Well, I didn't know that. <laughs> Chain type exospine. Oh, yeah? Exospines contribute to Eve's combat style. You can equip exospines to your equipment exospine socket to choose your desired combat style. They can be upgraded at repair consoles located in supply camps. Each upgrade unlocks additional features of the exospine. Neat. 
So what does this one do? Chain type exospine increases the attack power of combo attacks level two or higher by 27%. I mean, sure. I'm really not doing a lot of chains though. <laughs> I, re I should be because I've got two upgrades now that that boost chain damage, but I'm just spamming attacks, which to be fair is chain attacks. <laughs> It's just not as, uh, oh, fuck. Ah! Motherfucker, I hate these things so much. Oh, fuck. Oh, I didn't expect to do a follow-up. All right. What's in the box? Shit. <laughs> Alright. I can't access it right now. Shield Breaker! I mean, it did damage. That's all I needed. Ah, run, 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 run! Run! Woo! I'm losing my fucking mind! So as I was saying, uh... Really dislike how unresponsive... Trying to get the fuck out of dodge can be, oh boy. Hey, this is open now. Yeah, so it was just because uh, there were enemies ne either nearby or because I was in combat with one technically. Extreme nano element and a fusion cell. Oh. Hey, buddy. Just, just lurking around the parking garage. You need access? I'm about to open it up. Uh -oh. <laughs> the car hood was trying to take me over. Oh, that's why there were two fusion cells here, because they're going to put two in. I was hoping I was going to keep it for some, like, use one and then use the other one for something else. All right. Sure, I can use that camp. Is there... Do I care about this statue at all? I don't think it does anything for me. That's fine. I rest up. I'm going to leave these monsters alone. Oh wow, we've got lyrics. I'm kind of concerned. Why Why do we have lyrics? <laughs> Either really, uh... Trying to invoke some near- oh, jeez, the fuck is that? Yeah. Either really trying to invoke some near, or something's about to happen. The Truth, Article 3. Okay, we're gonna ignore it, we're gonna ignore it. Alright. The Shocking Brutality of the Legion, the private military contractor under the Orca Aerospace Company. First published in this paper with vivid on-site evidence. Planned conflicts occurring in the Third World. In-depth coverage of the PMC's cruel ethnic cleansing. Orca Aerospace Company's intentions? Maps of current resource disputes. Those are the Terminators, they show no mercy. The horrific truth revealed through a survivor's testimony. An exclusive report from our reporter Quinn, only in The Truth. And what was Smandy up to before monsters took over the world? 
Because clearly, uh, it was a lot of infighting still. Cannon Guardian. Natiba mutations are unstable and sometimes bring about violent changes. Those who cannot withstand the mutation self-destruct. Guardians with especially hard shells survive this to become Cannon Guardians, which can spit out explosives from inside their bodies. Cannon Guardians are living cannons. They continuously fire or scatter biological bombs. Cannon Guardians have a limited amount of ammo. They are most vulnerable when they are wiggling their bodies in attempt to reload. Oh, uh, okay. Definitely fucked up my button prompts there. I like dodged backwards as soon as it tried to do it, its fatal attack. Outcry to the sky. The network is down. The sky burns. The colony falls apart. Where is Mother Sphere? Why is the colony falling down to the earth? Answer my last call, Mother Sphere. Why? Why? You promised us salvation. Was it a lie? What in the fuck is Mother Sphere? And did a colony fall on Earth? Did they try to colony drop the planet? Is that what they were referring to earlier? About like, oh, something's falling through the atmosphere. I thought these guys just like died within the last day or something. Yeah, we still got lyrics. Ow. Oh, suicide. Well, yeah, okay. I do like this music. <laughs> do these just link up to the same area? Uh oh. Oh shit, there's more! I didn't know! I didn't know! I didn't know! See, the main problem with this music versus like Nier, like Nier Automata, the music in Nier Automata, you know, it had lyrics, but they're kind of like fake bullshit, like non actual <laughs> lyrics. Um, it's fake language, whereas this is actual lyrics. This is a little, a little distracting to me. Not like a bad, bad way, but I, I want it. I do want to know what the fuck she's singing. Oh shit! Ow! Oh no! Oh no! I'm gonna fucking schmeckled. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Ooh. Another soul for me to take. I mean, a core. May your memories live on forever. Do we get the memories when we take these cores? Does that mean we have to be the one that lives on forever? <laughs> I guess it went the wrong way. <laughs> Back into the metro tunnels. This is mo the most the paths have branched so far in this game. How do I get up there? All right. Ah, oh, shit, I didn't mean to do that. Well, we got a camp over here. I, 
think I got a skill point anyway, so... We're already getting into the territory where, uh... Things are costing two or three points. Oh, what the fuck? Oh, shit! All right. Dozer. Dozers are bizarre natibas that look like a mix of an insect and an animal. Their horns and shells are as hard as metal, making them essentially living heavy equipment. However, their brains have corroded so much that they can't do anything more advanced than headbutting. Okay, okie dokes, I guess. Fuck me, I wish there was any levels of, like, animation canceling. Okay, I'm gonna get some more health again. Oh, I can climb up over here. I was wondering about the <laughs> about this path. Oh, jeez. I hope that thing can't shoot me down. one of you is real. Yeah, neither. Useful. Let's see if they have anything inside of them. What is that tiny fucking thing over there? Whoa, what the fuck? It was just chilling out until I examined the body. Ensure thorough security procedures at the Lion Statue. Team Athena Leader. Used as a crafting material for nano suits. Well, I don't think I've been able to use those yet. I do want to, I really want to see what kind of like, big gameplay variances we can get with like the whole 
exospine and uh, nano suit changes. I don't know if I should be buying these. I don't even know how to use grenades. Okay, I press down to use a combat consumable. I'll, I'll try these out. At least next time I go into like a boss battle or something. Okay, let me go that way. So we'll check out over here first. Jesus. Oh, it's one of these. Okay, you gotta press the, uh... <laughs> you gotta press the corresponding arrow direction. Nice, I've got another... Omnibolt. Fixed damage gear adds fixed damage to combo attacks. What does that mean? Bonus fixed damage upon combo attack. 65. I don't even actually know how much damage I've been doing. Do we have damage numbers? I haven't fucking noticed. I'm just spamming attacks. Modular gear expansion designs have been implemented in various fields, including military gear. The military gear uses state-of-the-art technology from the Orca Aerospace Company, and each module costs millions of dollars. It's currently a must-have device for all Sentinels in Zion. Wow. Hey, little fucker. Are you a loot bug? Yeah, of course you were. What was that just now? It's a machine that collects relics. It's rare, so make sure to hold on to it if you come across one. Oh, that was a shortcut. Sort of. Got more HP! Yeah! Does the bar go up or nice! Always approve longer bars. Gotta remember to try to using that more often. I'm sure it's got like a decent bit of damage. They fucking just canceled me out of the attack. Okay, so no, we do not have damage numbers. At least not right now. It's an annoying thing when you have something that's like, it increases your static combo attack damage. I don't even know how much I do now. That can mean fucking nothing.
All right. Let's get some upgrades. New features unlocked. Use materials to enhance exospines. Uh, I can increase my crit damage. I don't know if I should invest in this one first. I'll... I'll do it just because I don't know when the next one I'm going to get is, and... I don't want to be, like, overly stubborn about these things. I'll go for Lingering Rush. Two whole skill trees that I have zero fucking idea what they do. I'm assuming one's gonna be like drone attacks or something. There's gotta be they, they, the game has talked about being able to upgrade the drone already, so something's gonna happen there. Uh, I will get protection gear. If I was a little bit more confident in my abilities in this game, I would have just gone for one of the other things, but I've just been having a rough time in this game so far. There's just like... It's one thing for like the parry stuff. That that I'm always gonna like kind of like suck at and just kind of like improve over time and hope for the best. But there are some things that are in this that are just gonna be like almost a permanent nuisance. Is that it? Yeah. <laughs> 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 I got jump scared. He was really dedicated to that. He said, I'm gonna try it for a second time here. Device. Yeah, that means I need a fusion, so I'll, I'll, I'll look around. <laughs> oh, it's over there. Well, I mean, I, that answers it, I guess. Hey, bud! I didn't know if that was, like, gonna lead into an attack or not. Ow! need to hit <laughs> mother's fear our beacon of hope our prophet have you forsaken us please save us from the nativas just do it before my damn faith runs out okay what is it trying to do obtain a fuse <laughs> yeah okay that's even less worthwhile than I thought it was gonna be 
I already have a fusion core. Hey, bud. Well, that's fucked up. Let's drop down. <laughs> there is another climb up area over here. And some kind of like food item, maybe? Yeah, it shows an apple. Double checking before I like drop down. What do you got on you, human? Legionnaire three hundred two sorrow. Why is the rescue team so late? We've lost connection to comps. I promised I wouldn't eat this garbage food again. We have to last until the rescue team comes. The body needs fuel to survive. I mean, you had quite a bit here. Just didn't work out. Uh, I was gonna say, I don't think I climbed up from here, actually. I don't know how to do that. Ability. Okay. <laughs> I'm just gonna practice fucking jumping over and over again because it. I I press X. Nice. In various parts of the falling, it just doesn't work out. I just take a fuck ton of fall damage. I know, but it's our only option. I really dislike this scan system in this. It, I just dislike systems like this in general, where half of the gameplay is just spamming this over and over and over again. I'd much rather have, like, a lingering, like, you press it once, and then it just stays that way for, like, 30 seconds to a minute. But when it's just like, okay, you got doing it over and over again for three seconds of highlighting. Like, you gotta be... Not like the way they have it set up in this for me to like that system. Where, like, it darkens the world, basically. Might as well be flashbanging me over and over again, too. Just received the comm signal from a new unit. The EVE protocol begins. Angels of death will descend from the colony. They will rid Natibas from... Form Earth <laughs> and save us. Mother Sphere's salvation is nigh. I'm thankful I lived through this hell for decades. Oh, nice. I got a cold. No, no, I don't know where the fuck that goes. Oh, here we go. <laughs> yeah, just... <laughs> through maybe I can get some upgrades for this scan thing and it'll be better that's <laughs> I hope because <laughs> this thing already annoys me like two hours into the game
because the, the the biggest soccer part is that it's actually it's really it's an effective scan <laughs> it, it shows me all the fucking enemies it shows me every single item that's around tells me a camp that's upcoming it's too nice to not spam over and over again I'll keep upgrading my my beta recharge. Oh, actually, I should I should grab ambush too. 